picks for June 2022 in no particular order, starting off with the Hyundai Palisade. We got a 2021 Hyundai Palisade. We purchased ours through Carvana um, just because of COVID and there wasn't a whole lot of stock at the dealerships. And the reason why it's on my top picks list for this month is all the incredible features that we have uh, found out about while driving around our vehicle. So the top things that I personally really like about the Hyundai Palisade is the safety features. Uh, the turn signal cameras in the dash that pop up, so when you hit your, your turn signal on your dash, it will show on either the left or the right, depending on your turn signal that you chose. It will pop up a side camera so that you can see on the side of the vehicle, so you can see how close you are to a curb of something, how close you are to another vehicle, uh, which is super helpful when parking. Your backup camera and the warnings and how it actually will press on the brake and not let you back up. It gives you a warning and it's actually been able to capture things before I've even been able to catch it because of blind spots. Some other safety features the vehicle has is like lane assist, cruise control, adaptable cruise control. Uh, we love all those features of this vehicle. The seats where each individual seat has its own heating and cooling. It has independent controls for each person that makes it very customizable and very nice, especially when my husband likes to have things way colder than me. I get cold and frozen very easily, so we're usually a couple degrees different. So I love that we have a vehicle that we can, um, both sitting in the front, have different air blowing on us. The miles per gallon for the SUV is not too bad either for a bigger vehicle. We got 26 to 27 on the highway going from Arizona to Idaho for just a quick trip over the Memorial Day weekend. So the miles per gallon is not bad for a bigger vehicle like this. So we like that about the Hyundai Palisade. And then it's a family friendly vehicle. There's space for literally everybody. We had like a full house not that long ago and we had kids in the back and then we had our friends in the middle seats and then we were in the front. We went to the zoo, we were able to go around places. It was really nice having that availability of all those seats and we had car seats in the back too. So it was, it's awesome. It's definitely a family friendly vehicle. Really recommend it if you're looking into like a, uh, a bigger SUV sort of size. I personally really wanted a Cadillac Escalade but we got the Hyundai Palisade anyway, and I'm converted. I definitely want, I like this vehicle more than the Escalade, which is saying something. Number two on my list is the Holy Bible app. You can get this either on Android or Apple. I run Android personally. You can see here as you scroll through, you've got all the different versions of the Bible that you can actually download. Um, I'm currently running NLT, the New Living Translation version of the Bible, but I like that you can download all the different versions of the Bible to have those readily available so that you can quickly compare and kind of get a better understanding of what the verses are trying to, to say. Um, I love the programs that are inside this app. Uh, I did one um, and it takes you through like step-by-step step of like, prayer verses and little like informational videos. Every day I have it send me uh, the verse of the day. And this is the thing that I love the most about this app is it will send it to me the verse of the day. And they also have stories kind of like a, a TikTok or a Snapchat video where they have a pastor that's somewhere um, where they break down the verse and they explain the verse of the day. I love that. It's great just to get a little bit of worship time in at any time of the day uh, that's specific for you. So if you're interested in that, definitely check that out. Number three on the list is a gorilla cart. We've been doing a lot of outside yard work and we needed something to easily transport a bunch of like limbs of trees and dirt and debris. Uh, eventually we're going to be actually removing rock from our front yard and placing it in the back so that we can put some new stuff out front and we needed a cart to be able to do that. I didn't want just a wheelbarrow. I personally don't think that wheelbarrows are uh, safe and secure. They're very easily unbalanced. Um, I've seen people get really hurt on them. The wooden handle thing and getting slivers in your hands. It's kind of issues with wheelbarrows. So there's a cart that's called Gorilla Cart. You can buy them at Lowe's or you can buy them on Amazon. And it's fantastic. It's uh, really easy to maneuver. It's got a dump handle and it literally completely like 
falls over, dumps out. Um, it's very easy to use. Only one person can use it or you can have two people there, but it's able to get the job done for the price of the product. Uh, it's fantastic and it's kind of fun, honestly, to like wheel it around and do your, your yard work with that. So definitely check that out. So number four on the list, another outside item is a rechargeable pool vacuum. We found this on Amazon. It was a little bit cheaper than what it is now online, but it's this cool little, uh, we call it a pool butt or our Wally because it's a little, you know, robotic device that you recharge. Um, it has like this little scraper thing on the bottom where it picks up debris, it goes through a net. It actually picks up really, really tiny dust and leaves and debris. Um, the recharge is a little bit longer for the actual like use time, but we've noticed if we use it every day or you can, you can almost get the ability to charge it twice in one day and be able to use it twice in one day. Um, but it definitely helps sustain your maintenance of your pool. It does not hook into your, your hose or into your system. It's completely separate, which I personally like that, that it's all one unit. You kind of take it apart, clean it out. Once it's done, you charge it up. It takes about three to four hours for one charge and it runs for about an hour, maybe a little bit more, depending on the charge that you get kind of goes around the pool, cleans it all up. It does go up the walls just a little bit um, using its little like power that it uses. It doesn't get up the walls completely though. So if you're looking for something like that, you're probably gonna be looking into a higher price bracket, but this little pool bud does an awesome job. We love using it and definitely recommend this product. Last but not least, Number five on our list is an inversion table. If you don't know what an inversion table is, it's kind of used in chiropractic use. You do it at certain degrees. So this inversion table that we have that was purchased on Amazon, uh, brand name Innova, it does 15 degrees, 30 degrees, and then 45 degrees. And it just puts you at a slight angle to where gravity isn't on you in the same way it's upside down. It allows your back to kind of stretch out and you can have some of your ver vertebrae kind of go back into place. If you're feeling really compressed and maybe you feel kind of like shorter than you should be, if you actually get on that, do a 15 degree decline, it will actually help give a little bit of space in your back. It also allows a deep stretch into your back and allows uh, you to kind of relieve some of your back pain that you might be experiencing just from compression and uh, gravity being on us all the time. I would definitely recommend though you talking to a chiropractor or your own personal doctor before using one as some people can have compacted discs and you can have issues with that. So before getting one and, and hoping that it fixes some of your back problems, ask your doctor first. Um, but it's been definitely helpful for me. I had like a lower uh, hip injury when I was younger in high school. Um, got into a car accident. So I'm pretty compressed in the hip area. And so going to the 45 degree angle, which you do have to work up to, you can't just hop on it and do it. You've got to slowly work into it. Um, going 45 degrees, I get just the most wonderful stretch in my hip area to where I can actually feel some relief um, and don't have to constantly be, you know, bending and stretching and trying to, you know, pop my back in and stuff like that. I don't have to do that as often when I remember to use the inversion table. It's been a while since you've done this. Yes, it has. How do you feel? Good. <laughs> Always remember to wear shoes. Just try to sit up at the same time. It helps. Don't blow a gasket. Feel like a different person yeah this body is now clean i'm just kidding <laughs> lean forward there you go good girl so those are the top five picks for june 2022 
If you're interested in any of these products, want to check them out for yourself, links are in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Remember, I love every single one of you. I hope that you have a great day. Remember to spread kindness to yourself and to others, and I'll see you in my next video.